just a little bit smaller. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. Happy Sunday. This is P over here. M over there. Patricia. Mariah. And together we, we are PM Artist Studio. Hello, hello. Welcome everyone. What are we doing today? Oh, we're working on P's book. The Celestial Gateway of and I tags to, and things. Yeah, and I'm not going to show you the tags until Tuesday. Taggy Tuesday. Taggy Tuesday. Tweaky Tag Tuesday. But I might Tuesday. have to get some of them out because it's going to be the next few steps are very crucial. Mm. Of course, that doesn't mean because I've already covered this other side up that you saw the other day. I decided I didn't like it, so I covered it up. Oh. But, I mean, you know, it just adds to the stability of the, it's it's not a big deal. Well, let's say hello to everybody and then we'll oh, show, okay. them, show them what yes, you got going absolutely. on there. Sorry. So, if you're hanging out with us, be sure to turn that chat over into live chat. Say hello in the chat if you would like us to say hello back. Otherwise, just hang out in the background. That is totally fine. Do give those thumbsy upsies right, you know, right, right below there. You say, I like this video. For those of you that know and, you know, my regulars. Our regulars. Absolutely. Our already friends. Yeah, all of you out there that we keep showing up. We <laughs> very much appreciate it. Because let some other people know, and then we're going to build our arty friends. Got our arty friend nation. All right, I'm going to say hello to everybody. It's quite the list. Woo! It's getting harder and harder. Are you ready? <laughs> all right, let's do this. We've got Angela. And hello, Angela, by the way, because it seems like you've kind of been away for a little bit. And, and I don't even know if you knew that all last month your artwork was the maker's header. I, I think know. she was traveling. Maybe. I believe I, I remember that. I'm so, sure. Angela, you missed out on your header thing. <laughs> You'll have to go back and look in the pictures. All right, I'm going to start this over. We've got Angela, Ann, Heather, Barbara, Barbara. So, that's Barbara Cabrera and Barbara Poole. we got Belinda, Candy, Carrie, Colleen, Darcy, Dana, Diane, Eddie, Evie, Griffin Chill, that's Rhonda, Jeanette, a.k.a. Jeanette, JoLynn, Joni, Judy, P, Kathy, Carrie, Kimberly, Linda, Lisa, Martha, Mary Ellen, Michelle, Nadine, Panka, Respect Design, that's Akiko, Silver Granny, that's Lynn, Sirius Hecka, that's our friend Lisa. How you feeling, Lisa? I hope that you are feeling better. Susan Dufresne, Tara is here. Is it Tara or Tara? Some, I think some people prefer uh, yes. one or the other. I would like to know that. Texture Junkies, that's our friend Sharon. The Shelly Studio, Tina, Trish Coogan, and we've got our friend Sherry from the Willow Rose Creations. Thank you all for saying hello. If I missed you, it wasn't on purpose. It's simply that the participant list didn't show you. And I don't know why that is. We've got Kim Diane here. All right. Awesome. Tara. Okay. Thank you. I shall note that for sure. Mitzi's here. Hello. All righty. All right, that's good. That one's good. I think I've already cut that one down. And then do keep in mind that Nightbot is our little friend that will be dropping in links typically to our website. You know, that's where you can shop. That's our shop. That's our shop. Where you can buy stuff and stamps. We encourage you to shop. We do. <laughs> but only buy what you absolutely need. Yes. <laughs> or really, really, really want. <laughs> that's yeah. okay, too. Um, and then uh, over to Makers, and that's our Makers of Mixed Media Art Artist Facebook group. If you don't know what I'm talking about, many of these lovely folks over here in the chat, hello Sandy, are members of that group, and that's where they post their awesome artwork. And we also have a million gazillion, only about five, um, <laughs> part uh, challenges, prompts, all kinds of fun things to engage with. We have the Makers Creative Collab, and that's the one that we do both with our friends there, the non-YouTubers of Makers, and then the YouTubers put together a little video hop thing, and that will be going on, I believe, this coming Saturday. That makes sense as far as the timing of things. I just don't have the exact date, but it will happen most likely this Saturday at 2 p.m. Watch out for that. The theme for that one is the Dream Weavers. If you guys haven't posted your stuff, um, that's totally fine. If you're a non-YouTuber and you're makers, just, you know, take your time. Plus, Joni made a great suggestion, and we've suggested this before many a times, that you can mix them up. So, um, those of you that are in the ATC swap, you can mix that and then put the color challenge in there. That's headed up by our good friends, 
Carrie Griffiths and Paula. And poor Paula is still in the naughty chair. I don't know who put her there. It wasn't me. Facebook has just I don't decided. Even know. I wouldn't even know how to do that. I do not so know. I am not guilty. Poor girl. <laughs> um, so, yes. And uh, I know this this earth, this earth, this is very early. Because we're one hour. More than, you know, back. and uh, I'm feeling it a little bit. Feeling it a little bit. But I went to bed really early. But then I got up and wandered around for a couple hours in mm -hmm. the nighttime. Okay. I'm going to go topside. You cool with that? I am. Okay. I'm ready. Oh. Carrie Griffiths has already... He said, be scared. Be very scared. I've already started co collated color combo requests <laughs> for 2024. Oh, good lord. I, mean, I tell you, that man is organized, and I love it. I mean, I just, he, he, goals, goals. He's, he's my hero. I, that's, that's what started me cleaning, you realize. Well, that I, one video hey, that you I know watched. what? I wish it was me, but it's okay if it's Carrie Griffiths. It is because you just nag me. <laughs> he, he provides Support. avenues of, of actual suggestions and why they are a good suggestion. You just <laughs> piss and moan. <laughs> <laughs> Carrie, either way. It's fine. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Here's the book. Here's the book. Now, here's the next thing. Uh -huh. All right. So, we're going to open some doors. Hi, here. Jacqueline. Hi, Betsy. Oh, yeah. Gayla's here. Um, I'm, I redid the back of this one. You remember what? Look, am I in, in camera? Yes, but one second. Hello, Paper Puddles. Who are you? Would you like paper us to? Oh, I, I know. Love I love it. that name. Uh, if you want us called by, by your name name, we, we can do that. But I do love the Paper Puddles. Hello, Ann Lar. I'm so glad you're here. And let's see. Did I miss? Devin's here. Awesome. That's Yolande. Okay. Look at, look at that more marvelous gesso wing. It's got little weird things stuck to it. I don't know what they are. <laughs> I've been dusting, been so God knows it could be anything. Place. All sorts of things. All sorts of things. I love this. The I level, love it. The, love it. the level, yeah. Okay. You know, usually I don't have to dust or do things like that on a regular mm -hmm. basis because I move often enough that you just take care of it when you move. And you know, here's the other thing, because I was thinking about this. That, you know, number one, we have... Four adults and one kid in this house. And three animals. Three animals. That's, that's just a lot of people and things moving around, things that go outside, rolling the dirt, bring dirt in. Yeah, well, the kid can be added to the... We've the, actually got four animals. Because, <laughs> I mean, she comes in sometimes she is and it's filthy. just like, good, how, how <laughs> did you get that in your ear? I mean, well, I remember that one day when it rained. I mean, she ended up in the mud twice. Now... The first Some, time no. we do think it was an accident. The second, although she, was, I don't, yeah. Anyway, she's she's messy. She's a piglet. <laughs> Hello, Tamari. Oh no, I better cut that off a little bit that way too. All right, now I'm gonna let you go and you do your thing there. All right, all right. Well, I'm gonna have to cut this off because when you close the door, and I I really, I'm I'm going to. Try to center that right in the middle of that. I got a twitch. <laughs> a, tw a twitch? Oh, I That's hate making that happens. Okay, so that needs to be cut down. Now, I need to check this one. This is the stage where it's very crucial. And if I were a really, you know, fabulous planning person who was able to anticipate and, and plan ahead. Oh, my gosh. I have to tell you, I made a bracelet tree. That is so cool. I'll just study it. We need to take a picture of it. And we will and post it. All we right, might. see, I'm glad I checked that. Because remember, this is going to be perforated here. I'm going to lace it. Hello, Lisa. And I can't remember who was it that did the lacing. Uh, Lisa is quite known for the, you know, kind of bodice lacing business. Well, it's going to be sort of like that. But I cut off the top of this one already, obviously. And I just now cut off the top of this one. Because I want them to remain behind these doors. And I don't want them sticking over. So I'm going to have to trim them a bit more. And I apologize. It drives me crazy when people are chopping things. I really want one of those kind of nice little roly, roly. Um, yeah, the roller that, ones. That, you know, don't sound like Marie Antoinette's losing her head. 
Is that what you think about every time you yeah. say guilty? Hi-ya. Off with her head. Off with her head. <laughs> and I need to focus here because I just need a little bit, not a lot. Okay. But it's not. It's going to be okay because the doors are still. All right. So. And I'm not going to take quite as much off this. One. Oh, hello, Janice Marie. And Stephanie is here. Hello. <clears throat> but we're going to cover some of these today. Well, I hope we are. Hope we make it that far. Well, and I tell you, it would be a heck of a lot smarter to cover them now before getting them sewn in. It's a yeah. lot easier. <laughs> yes. Did we learn something from the last little? Yes. But I was so excited about doing my, my weaving. And I even went through the chindy rugs. Well, I had to because that's what I covered my yeah. bracelet tree with. And I'm all ready to crochet. And I'll probably crochet. Hey, Marcia. I don't know. I don't know if I'll crochet on Tuesday or not. I don't know that I'll be ready to. Yeah, it might be next decision. Tuesday. Yeah, Tuesday. Tweaky Tuesday. But next, not this one, but the next one. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> it's Sunday. It's Sunday. <laughs> Today is Sunday. There's a Tuesday coming up, and then there's another one after that. Hopefully and another just, one after that. I just... <laughs> I, I, you know, I've been sleeping in different beds every night. <laughs> I just, it's just like, and and the baby's been sleeping with me a lot. Thank God she didn't last night. I mean, I really was ready for a little, a little break. A little break. It's nice having Melly here. It's like oh, a, I know. Another, it's a whole another. Yeah, we can to... rotate her out, and everybody can get one a good night's sleep every third night. <laughs> she hasn't been with us though. She doesn't. She likes sleeping with the Gigi or the Lola. All right. Now, I'm not even going to... The other thing I learned is don't round off your edges till you're done. Yes. Because it's a lot easier to cut. Oh, I should have cut on that side. Look at that little... Oh, well, you know. It'll be right. tell by the time I get it uh, covered. So, we've got to decide on a background. Mm -hmm. And I don't know that I'm going to use a front door on these. I, I might just have it be, you know, no doors. The <laughs> doors are only on the front. Oh, so like you just use different prints, not, not yes. any of the celestial gateways. Yes. Okay. Because see what I'm going to do is see how you line these up here with the tabs. And I'm going to sew, whip stitch, sew that on there. That's going to be my, my thought. Now, I'm not going to sew it on at the, the base there. I'm going to try to sew it on in the middle. Mm -hmm. Because what remember what Carrie was talking about? He said he was afraid it was still going to alligator. Well, it would if I just kept adding it down there. Because then it wouldn't be a spine. It would just be a closing mm -hmm. device. Mm -hmm. So if I keep that Hi, up Violet. there, can you see how that elevates that? Or will once it's stuffed with tags. Right. Trust me. I have some tags. I, I and then mine is completely stuffed. I'm gonna have to decide if I don't know. Might need to add some more accordion or perhaps even add some pockets to the back. Oh. And I may just accordion it versus the gatefold. Because when you gatefold it, it, it's pretty poofy. Yeah, yeah, and I think that's. That's mm -hmm. what I have to keep in mind here. Mm -hmm. It is. <coughs> Hello, Janice. Pardon me. Hello, okay, Patricia. Okay, so I'm going to open it up so you can see the other side, too, because I'm, I'm really quite you. proud of this little... Okay, you, you watched me pull this this print. When I pulled it, I was like, well, I'm probably not going to use that. But I really love that color. Remember how I got that color? It yep. was. It had some of that... <laughs> Y'all remember that? And Danthrene in it. I can't remember what else. But I... This was actually the same as this how did you i'm looking at that what stencil it, it has is three that? different things over it no but the kind of black and whitish middle one there oh it's not black it's actually dark green well yeah okay so that but what stencils did you use or is that when you were no it, it's this I, I have the here's what it looked like before i Man, that's crazy. It just looks so different. Well, it's because of the the 
Um, so it's the Peacock Swirls. It's Peacock Swirls. That's available in our shop, Peacock Swirls. I, I mainly use that by on, Darcy. on the background. And I could do that on, <laughs> do parts of this on this side. You know. See, they knew. They're like, it's the new Peacock one. <laughs> That's a good thing we've got people paying attention here. Um, I could put part of that on this side, and then that would... But look at this. Isn't this wonderful? Is it in camera? You are in camera. I, I, I moved it up, and you see where I got you centered oh, now. Oh, yes. Good. Good, because I always felt like I was yeah. over here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. So, <clears throat> I tore this. And I'll hey, take that darn... Carnival tissue, what makes it really strong also makes it a pain in the butt when you're tearing it because it doesn't <laughs> right. doesn't want to tear. You just, and you can see I got some long straggly things that I actually had to pull off. And I got down here and it yeah, just barely. Then I took Yeah. Before I I glued it down, I laid it down on a piece of the deli paper and used the um now which one I used. I'm pretty sure it was Twilight. Because I decided, I, you can tell my finger, um, okay, so here's what I did. I have these two, right? This is Pink Fresh Studio. Stargazer's the color. S Stargazer's the color. This is Twilight. Well, one of them is kind of greeny, I mean, that lid is sucked down on there. That's and good. I've got some paper that I saved from... Oh, Devin likes, would like to know, can you tear it with a ruler? I, you you can, but sometimes it doesn't even... You know, it'll catch. Yeah. And then when you... you it's still... All right, I'm going to use the same finger because <laughs> I've already got it underneath. I look like I've been working on it. So I'd say that's the one that has cards. a bit of a greenish hue to it. Yeah, I think so, too. And so I, I used the little pouncer sponge thing. I don't think she's wet tearing, no. What? Did you wet tear? Oh, oh no. I don't ever do that. <laughs> it's just an extra added step that really doesn't facilitate me in any way, shape, or form. Unless you're peeling stuff off. Remember when I peeled off the yes. modeling paste? That worked like a... All right, so the, so the Stargazer has more of a purpley blue blue. Yes. And the Versa has a greenish. Well, and it could be because I've been adding. Of course. Because I didn't have the other color. Everyone, please note that anything and everything that we ever show, product-wise, unless you have seen us take the, the packaging and it is brand new, most likely has been altered. <laughs> In some way or form. <laughs> not, in no, not sometimes not intentionally. Right. I forget to, I forget to wipe off my uh -huh. stamps. So I'm not one of those people. Hey, Anthony. I just deal with it, you know. Is that our our Anthony Cody? Yeah. Oh yeah. The Baron Maker. Okay, so you can see the difference in those two. But here's what's weird. You see this right here, right? You see that color right there? After I glued it down, it turned into this color here, which that was not intentional. I wanted it to be more of a darker kind of greenish so it would go with this side of the business here but that didn't happen happy birthday Carla just did not happen and I you know it's okay That's I, I kind of it, it, it goes with something but you know at this point this is what Mariah used to say mom I love your artwork it doesn't matter where where I put it in the house it goes with something <laughs> because I pretty much have every color that yeah it, yeah of the of the rainbow but All it's right. usually not happy rainbows. It's, you know, grungy junkyard rainbows. <laughs> That's in the, the, I mean that in the it, most it, heartwarming, yes. loving way. Okay, well, now I've got a blue finger again. It's like Mariah said, you just... <laughs> By the time it wears off, you get some more on it. it it's time time to re-up. <laughs> Obviously, re I haven't been arting every my, day. <laughs> yeah, my fingers are not... I can tell I haven't been working on anything. Huh. Okay. All right, so what we're doing today is we're deciding what we're going to cover these <laughs> next pages yes, with as, after all of this blah, 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 blah. Now, see, this is this is also the peacock. Yes. This 
particular piece of paper has been stamped from the front and the back. So that one wasn't gel printed with the um, stars all lit and up. It was stamped. stamped. Yeah. Now, I love that stamp. Also this one. And this has been covered. It's both sides too. You can kind of tell more on it. <laughs> but what's to. cool about stamping both sides with the tissue paper, it's almost like, you know, it, it's, it's, it intensifies your layers. Uh-huh. Because you can just really, and then I just out here I just kind of because really physically, the vermilion. physically speaking, physically speaking, that if you because it, it is by you know whatever hair of a hair hair hair, literally, literally, one is in front of the other. Yes, not just you know on top. Of, it, it's it's like what what is it C conjunction? Is it conjunction? The you know the over under side. What what is that? Um, it's not conjunction. I can remember Mrs. Gore, and she had this bird on a stick. And she had a little birdhouse. And this is how she would teach it. Over the birdhouse. Under. Side. I mean, but obviously it stuck. I mean, it really, yeah, yeah. now if I could remember what it's actually called, what, what you call those when you're saying. Directional device. Directional instructions. Yeah, but it's I, a, I don't know that. But it's a word. <coughs> to describe those words. And I'll tell you what, the other thing about cleaning is you stir up a bit of dust. I don't know. Probably most of you don't, but. We usually keep a very. I told Mariah, I said, honestly. Halloween. Some of this stuff has not been dusted since I moved here four years ago. Uh, try five years. Oh, my goodness. Because well, this that is about to be. that would explain its furry content. Yeah, because yeah, this if is about to be If it hasn't been six. used regularly, <laughs> yeah. it, it had a bit of, yeah, fur on it. Okay. Conjunctions. Conjunctions. Yeah. Is that what I said? Oh, yeah. I remember that yeah. little conjunction. Junction. Function. Jo Joni, Joni, Joni M. was saying that, too. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I, Preposition. Prepositions. Uh -huh. Yes. Yes. That's the word. That's the word. That's the word we were looking for. Mm -hmm. Now, I do, you know, I'm not, I'm not just telling you about this covering, because I do have doors. <laughs> I don't necessarily, I don't know why the middle door, I just didn't make that many middle doors. And I've used, oh, I know, because I messed up that one. Remember, I put it on upside Position. down. Mm -hmm. Had to tear it off. I still have the remnants of that somewhere. I should dig that out and use that. See, not only already fun, but a little English. Yeah. English. Mm -hmm. Yeah, prepositions. Oh, oh con right. conjunctions right. connect like and and but. <laughs> and uh what is the one on no that would be a preposition on is a preposition yes okay let's get with it here <laughs> I, I'm, I'm i don't know okay now i want to show you these again because and i I'm, I'm so proud of myself oh my god you found another oh no i've always had them Oh, I just thought you I need needed, another another. I needed another another. But now I really need another to actually use for printing because I'm not printing on these. I think they're absolutely stellar as they are. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Now I'm going to put these and lean them up here so that they don't get lost in a pile. <laughs> okay. Well, if I didn't hear you say friend. Oh, it's and, but, and, or. But now, look at that. How fun English can be. I mean, you know, you look at that Woo! and you go, oh, my God, that's pink. <laughs> and then you put the stars on it and you go, oh. oh, my gosh, isn't that wonderful? Look at those little pinky boogers shining through there. And then you put it over this. Look at this. Ooh. Oh. It's the proximity of the other color that changes okay. that color. So then I decided, now I've got a little extra strip that I might put in somebody's. Have we set mm -hmm. out the pink one yet? But I might need it so you can't Yeah, no, it. I already see yeah, it. It's packaged and ready to go. All right, and so here are my all of my little scraps you can see. See, this is how they start. This is how it starts. And then we get very fond of them and, and hold on to them, and then hopefully one day we'll be able to re release them to all of y'all. <laughs> And I don't know what I, I don't have anything on the play. I don't, what did I do with my greens? Oh, wonderful. Paula can now comment in Makers. Well, wonderful. Yay. 
I kicked her out and brought her back in. We were hoping that would help. <laughs> I have another whole pile. Imagine that. Remember we were doing the, I showed you the greens? Mm -hmm. Okay. Don't need that right now, but I do need to keep that within reach because I kind of did lose it. All right, so you see how this looks. This is total complement, well, not total complementary, but sort of kind of. But then if I pull in the green, the really foresty green, I get another whole effect there. Oh, wow. Isn't that interesting? It is. And then if I pull <laughs> in this one, you know, Brian's, I don't like that at all. No. I think it's too much, it's too close in value to the area around. So mm -hmm. we'll definitely put that aside. But now what about this? Okay, tried that. Now where's my... Look at that. That's kind of cool. I like the pink the best though. I do like the pink the best. Now, I could flip this over and use this side, but you can see that doesn't do anything. So I need a really dark. Yeah. The pink mm -hmm. is just the best all the way around. With the purple especially. It really, and I like it, but I like it with this also. Yeah. So I don't know, you know? And then I've got some others here that are just little, I, I, and the thing about it is, oh, I am not going to decide. Well, that's kind of interesting. That is kind of, but I think it needs to be lighter. Mm -hmm. What about the orange one? Well, let's try it. Sometimes you're surprised. I don't think it's going to work because of the other, yeah. Mm -hmm. It needs to be a solid. Yeah. I have decided that. Yes. Because I've used it with the, um, so it really does, and you know how, hard it is for me to pull a solid colored. <laughs> True that, Lynn. True that. What? <laughs> it's just, it's just, so watch out, folks. There will be an epic flood of Paula comments as she thrives to catch up on everything. <laughs> yes. Don't, don't feel pressured, Paula. Yeah. All right. So we've decided that pink is really the way to go. Yes. And I could, and let me bring back the book. And I've got a lot of, I got a lot of deli, pieces of deli paper here that I've been mucking about with and Mariah's been spraying on. But I, I've retired a lot of my, because they have such lovely things on them. I think that's good for some more. <laughs> yeah, that one needs a little more. But that, that one needs. that you have been using, I swear, for like a year. I, seriously, <laughs> I'm retiring this because I so think fantastic. this is just absolutely wonderful. And actually on both sides. And I, I do have a place for those. Because they do have some wonderful things on them. Ew. So, we've got these. And I really, I'm kind of leaning towards the, using the jelly paper, the, the deli paper as a backing for <laughs> Jelly <these>. deli. <laughs> jelly deli. <laughs> Howdy doody. And, and this has already kind of started here, so I can smooth it out so the wrinkles are but it's stronger and remember this is going to be my pockets and I don't know I'm really in a quandary should I cut the pockets prior to backing them or should I oh and the thing about it is is I can change the color yeah I think so so maybe it's not such a good idea to I mean unless you want them all the same then yes then I would glue the paper down or whatever but if you want more option, after. I think so. And I don't think it's going to be a problem because here's what I, how I'm going to cut them. Because I love, I have to have these all, these edges. So I figure I can get that this is a deep enough pocket. Mm -hmm. Okay? And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go around the stars and just you know, mark a point where I'm going to end up here. Mm -hmm. So that it's a very it's a const organic. constellation pocket. A con oh, constellation pockets. How about that? But that's where this is going. So the next time you see this, I, I don't want to commit to the color of my pockets till I have my innards done. Mm -hmm. 
that's that's oh gosh isn't that wonderful and see sometimes you can't I sprayed just, that one Ooh. that's not good. it's a lot of the look same at, look at this i like that i think that is really and then the green one with the pink and the green with the pink and then it'll sort of be mm, i love it all right well i may not need to do any more yeah i i just i lost all these papers there for a bit and I, I, i'm really happy that i found them okay well we'll put all those together um boy do we have a have a lot that i'll be adding to packets wonderful for sure for sure, for sure. but now we do need to go through these before we decide to give them away i've been trying to put things back in the same place my grandmother used to say if you put things back in the same place twice <clears throat> you are more likely to remember it, where it is. And I think she was absolutely right about that. Mm -hmm. Okay, we've got some things here we could use for our back, our inside. I so this is back. on the panel? This is on the actual panel. Now okay. this is a possibility. Yeah, I love I'm that one. I'm gonna hold that one out. Okay, these are all my solid greens. Probably don't need those. Oh, there's another piece of gel. Oh, this is all my deli paper. Oh, I need to put that out. <laughs> I don't know if that's it. Oh, watching you do this makes me understand how certain things happen at times. How they happen? Because you kind of like, you bring it over and then this pile becomes the same pile and you've merged things. It's, you're kind of like playing that nut game, you know, with the... <laughs> you know. It is an intention. I know. <laughs> I assure you. <laughs> this is a definite possibility. Yes. We have to tear that up. Love it. And I can even tear this up. Because yes. I, I don't, it, it's not going to, but I need to think about this because remember I need to cover the back. You may want to keep that for your back. Okay, you know what, while I'm deciding all of this, can I hand that over to you and can you glue down the back? Sure. Because I don't think people need to actually see that. Well, they've but seen this see glue what thing. we're talking about here? Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of it. it yeah, you'll have it for a long time. What is it? She got some of the freezer paper. Rhonda got some of the freezer paper. Oh, yeah, the big box. Uh, it, it's lasted for a long time. And so, you know, you're going to have to deal with the... It slides under the desk real nice. That's what happens here. Okay. Now, see, these two could be good together. See what I'm saying? That could be good for a door. Oh, look, and I even wrote a note to myself on this one. Oh, and there's a medium door. I'm not going to get up. So, uh, this was placing the stencil onto the plate after the print. Violet oxide open and phthalo cyan blue. Red shade. Lip protect soft body. <laughs> is what was this one. Now this one might be really, this might be nice. It's kind of subtle. I kind of like it with this. I don't know. All right, We're, that's a definite possibility. We're gonna keep that up there. I'm sorry, I'm just yammering on here. I don't like that. Now that might be a good one to use strips of with these. See what I mean? Because you have to think the opposing doors need to have a relationship somehow. Opposing doors, yes. I, I mean, would think, yes. Uh, not doors, but the opposing inside. Uh, yeah, spread. Yeah. Needs to have something in common. Aw, paper puddles. Carrie, thank you so much. Welcome to Palsy Wowsy. I just love paper puddles. I know, that's, that's so cool. Okay, definitely, definitely, definitely. <laughs> Okay, I may have to put, oh, now we've got this, and this is very interesting, and I've got that. I have Hello, lot, Lollipop. I have a lot more of these than I really needed, but you never know. Oh, that See, one's See, they're all lovely. different colored goals. That one's so awesome. Isn't it? So... P now is this a, looks really good with the purple also. She's showing all the different prints that she's pulled over the last few weeks. Um, trying to figure out, because she's got some new panels that she's going to be putting into her book. So, 
you know, the, the decision-making process. Yes, it's happening. The struggle is real. <laughs> it, it, it is. And it just is because... Now, one of the things that, you know, I feel pretty okay about is if I take one part of this and put it on the brown panel with maybe some strips of gold because this is this side's going to be the bigger door everybody gets that right this side over here is the big door I think. this side over here is the smaller door so I want to use the smaller because I can go like this on it I can strip it horizontally rather than vertically like I did the other mm -hmm. one but I think that that would be nice. And then we have to consider, you know, that it's going to also have on it a pocket. And I think I'm going to have to put, I, I didn't want to put pockets on the doors, but I may have to put a pocket on the inside door just well, to kind of help balance things out. We could do the vellum pockets. Well, we could. The only thing I don't like about the vellum is we're going to have to back it with something a little more substantial. Because it's going to be, it's, it's going to receive a lot of wear and tear. Well, we could, um, we could do the pocket and mod podge it and then glue it on. Oh, that's probably a little bit more than you <laughs> needed. I have a little device here that you got can it. scoop it up with. I got it. I'm okay. on it. All right, well, we need to make a decision here. I'm really leaning towards this one because it's got blue in it. And I, I do love this one, and I think it goes really well with this. But I'm not sure that brown is the way that I want to go on the interior. It does have a bit of orange in it. I always have the option of over printing them with just a solid color to get it into the color range that I'm I'm really interested in. Or I learned that you can take and sponge on the um, <clears throat> you can <clears throat> you, 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 I just have, sometimes that stuff just gets caught there and it doesn't I go know. either way. It tickles, way. it tickles and it tickles. And then it's just, a, it feels like, you know, you've got a lump, <laughs> lump in your throat. Okay, I've got to find, yeah, here, this, is, this leans towards the greenish gold. Can you see the difference in these golds? Isn't that amazing? I mean, you know, I don't know. This one... The stars show up a little bit more, but I can go ahead and, pardon me, stamp this with some more, and I think it would be interesting to stamp it with the um, same colors I did on the other. Okay. All right, I think we've gone through all of these now. Oh, here we go. Here's a completely blank slate, practically. A flop off. Use Naples Yellow Open Permanent Maroon. Mixed violently on the plate until well integrated. Two pulls, flop off, and positive print on plate to dry. Ha! Look at all that information. Look at all that information. Look at all that information. Now, this might be a good one to overprint. Because I've already got some of that blue on there. That's too shiny. Oh, look at this print. It's so beautiful. Isn't this gorgeous? All right, I want you to know that this was a little, a little tricky. Hey. Whatever you do there, it will look better than if I did it a whole piece. I was going to tear it. Oh my, I think that looks lovely. It already has wrinkles on it. Well, and, you know, it cuts here. Does that anger you? Where? What? Like here. Oh no. Okay, I was about to say, if you say something it's ugly on it. Yeah, it's, it's, that's, yeah, I don't really care about that. And then... <laughs> I mean, I was kind of hitting right oh, on. Oh, that's all right. We can we can. Um, but I, hit it with the. Uh, okay, perfect. You that's, know the stuff. That's the right attitude. Hit it with the stuff. The whole thing is, if it isn't as perfect as you want it to be, which you know. I, I, oh, hello, Kirsten. I'm not 
big on that anyway. I don't really care about that. Kirsten did her first color challenge, and she has the most lovely Scottish accent. Oh! And she's, it, yeah, it's, it just, it, it was wonderful. Um, <laughs> Wonder, wonderful to behold? Yeah, well, you know, and I think, it's like, she just, she really went through the process, and, and, and you know, I don't know that, um, you know, she, ha she had some areas where it was like, I, I could tell that things weren't necessarily going the way that she wanted to, but man, she stuck with it, and I, I think that the end result was fantastic. You know, that's, that's what I, I really appreciate that about people, and, and, and Carrie's a good one, too. It, it, it might not be happening like he wants it to, and you can tell it does bother him, but <laughs> right. he doesn't give up on it. He just, yeah, and I'm, you know, those are the kind of people that make a difference in the world. The people that, you know, just... You keep at it. Get it perfect the per first time. You're just kind of like, well, isn't that interesting? Well, and I don't know mm. that that happens to anybody. Uh, I don't... It certainly isn't... I, I can't remember the last time that happened. All right, real quickly before we start here, I want to go ahead and stamp on... Well, maybe I should wait because I might use the vermilion. Oh, decisions, decisions. And it's not going to work to stamp through the back because I've already got <laughs> Naples yellow, obviously, on the back, so that stars are not going to shine through. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's okay. We can have them on. Right. Hey, hello, April. She says she loves your necklace. And where do you get all those <gasps> lovely berets? Well, this one, this is the hat that she absolutely hates. This one was brought back from Thailand. No, Mar Margie made it on the trip to Thailand because you're on the airplane for 18 hours. And it's made with silk. Um, it was kind of stinky for a while, but after, you know, many washes and lots of, you know, sweat. And it's also been mended. Yes. Because it's ravelly. Yeah, it, it starts to just kind of. And Marky made this one, and look at That's has, her sister. It has a renaissance. Yes. Poof. Yes. <laughs> That's what we're it's calling It's actually polar fleece. Yeah. And I, I love it. I, I wear it all the time. And it's kind of chilly here today, and I have all the windows open to air out the dust and must and whatnot. Okay, here. Uh, do you want me to trim it off first? or do you Well, wanna... that would be absolutely lovely because okay. you know how I suck at that. Okay. I, I, I trim things. If I really like stuff that comes in really fat, if you make a fat tag, because yep. then I can put my scissors right against it and just scoot them mm -hmm. along there. But if I have to visualize, if I have to visually do it because it, I get off and I, I've already messed, I messed up one of the tags. But and you gotta be careful here. I chopped it. Yeah, you don't. Want oh to, yeah, don't cut my ribbon. Yeah, I don't want to cut a binder, binding. That'd be a real hot mess. Yeah, Shit and in business. I, also I can come in with the little scissors if there's any things hanging out. All right, let's get on with it here. Yeah. I think before I stamp, I'm going to go ahead and get try to get these into the color house of these. Wonderful. It doesn't have to be exact, but I want the pa opposing pages <clears throat> front and back to have something in common, right? And it's best if you have enough stuff, because you start and all of a sudden you're going, oh, holy cow, I don't have enough paper to finish this page. Then you're in deep doo-doo. Yeah. Because you won't have something to help it repeat. So that's what we're going to do here. Okay, that pile goes there. I'm pretty much done with that one. I'll alternate it so I know that. <laughs> I'm talking to myself. Uh -huh. I'm really not. Yeah, okay. Unfortunately, and fortunately, I have, you know, I kept saying that I really didn't. But once I cleaned off my desk area here, this area and this, and I, I had a place to put my paints and whatnot, I don't have all this stuff here, so I can accommodate my 12-inch plate. Now, you will notice on the acetate, and Mariah and Brad are, when we get through with the website. It is coming along. Here's uh, the update. You can Hold see on. that it's, it's a little bit, it yes. hangs over just a little bit, and that's probably not wonderfully good, but I, it doesn't really matter because I think I'm probably going to cut some of that off anyway. I, I really think by next by next Sunday, it will happen. Because we're, we're just mainly in the testing 
stages of things. We just want to make sure that, you know, when you guys get in there, it isn't like, oh my God, you know, why isn't this working? Or, you know, this, that, the other. So, yeah, because that's really em embarrassing. It's embarrassing. And and, and, and and it's not a very good advertisement for... No. Um, <laughs> We'd like you guys to stay and hang out and, you know, yeah. shop and... All of those things. Enjoy the shopping experience. <laughs> okay, so I need to get my color that I'm trying to get at least a little bit of. Yes, we have the time change. Yep, this yep. has everything on it, so this is going to kind of... Oh, hello, Ricky! <clears throat> I think I'm going to go lighter rather than darker. Look at that. That's the back. That's the back. But you can see how this really no, works I love that. well. So I'm going to try to replicate this in a little bit using the bigger um, plate, the bigger peacocks. Mm. But we've got to get an under one on there first. Under. An under. Layer one. Layer one. And I don't know if I can use, I mean, why not? I can go ahead and just put this down. And that'll be like I've already got two layers hey, Martha. here. All right, Hello, let's Christy. do that. You snuck in there. If it doesn't work out, we'll do something else. All right, we're going to go with this little bit greener. It's the turquoise, and it's Utrecht. Oh, that little sticker isn't sticking very good. Well, that's one of the old ones. Oh. Yeah. And it probably is the part where I pulled off the paper. Probably. That happens. Okay, so we're going to go with a little of this, and a little of that, and a little of this. And you know how I, I like to mix them up here. And I'm so excited that I got my new burnt orange so I, I can use it with abandon. Because mm. I have three tubes of it now. These two colors mixed together make a really nice neutralized it's not really brown. Oh, is, is our Paula here as Paula? I mean, that's confusing me. <laughs> what is? I think Paula's here as Paula. She has, you know, she used to be stitching arc. And then she changed her, her little icon thing, which also throws me off. You know, I get trained. <laughs> it's kind of like, you know, Photoshop really irked me whenever they changed their um, eraser icon. I mean, it really messes with me to this day. <laughs> what is it? So they, in their tool, in their tools, in Photoshop, they change their eraser icon. Okay. And it still messes with me. I was just, I'm, I'm visual, man. I, I'm just, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. That's, I, exactly. I don't know what the problem was. <laughs> okay. So we've got a little bit of that. Now let's let's mix that up and see what that looks like. Because I do want it somewhat. Hey, Tracy. I do want want it somewhat transparent. Okay. <laughs> Ooh. Uh -uh. I don't care if we have little goopy gobbies of, of whatnot there. That, right. Different. I think that just adds to the interest. Okay, so this is I, I would like it to be a little tiny bit more transparent, so we're going to bring in some gloss medium. Hello, oh. Sonia. Not a lot, just a little to kind of, you know, thin it out a bit without destroying the integrity of the uh, paint. Mix it up. M mix it good. Now, I can do it with the brayer, but when I'm mixing in any of the retarder or the um, medium, medium, I do really like to make sure that it's well mixed because it will leave bald spots. And I don't That's mind a good it. way to describe it, bald spots. Bald spots. I've been trying to think about how to, you know, describe that, 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 that blank little blob <laughs> that happens. When you do and, it. it. It doesn't hurt to do a bit of, you know, violent. Yeah. Look at those sharp points, see. <sighs> mm -hmm. 
But look at that. That is an absolutely fabulous color. And you watched me mix it right here, so you're going to know exactly how to make that color. And, and I won't have to remember it. So are we in beta? Yes, Barbara. We, we are in, in beta. <laughs> beta. We're staging. We are in staging right now. Oh, Where we're testing it all out. Gorgeous color. And it might be a little bit... Mm, I'm, I'm, gonna, I, I'm going to spray her off just a bit more. Make it a little bit more transparent. <laughs> oh, testing the time. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. You know what? You know, poor Brad. He, 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 I'll tell you what, he, he's a trooper. He's... It, be, because uh, a lot of our, what do you call them, helper? Pro developers. Developers, thank you. Developers are in India? Yes. Pakistan, India. 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 India, India. Okay, so their time, when we're asleep, they're awake. Yeah. So he's up at like 2.30 in the morning. I'm talking with them. Okay, check this out, ladies Ooh. and gentlemen. Oh, this is going to be lovely, 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 lovely. Okay, it may not be the color that I want it right now, but I like it, and what I like is what's left there. We have a, a really nice... The Song of the Brayer, yes, exactly. A really nice transfer, and I'm thinking I can get it because we used Retarder. And look at that. Nary a wrinkle. Song of our people, yes. What? <laughs> the squeak of the brayer brings all the artists to the yard. <laughs> oh, perfection. Perfection. Snowy peacocks. Look at that. Isn't that fab? Oh, I'm smelling the smell of my new gel plate. It just, you know, it really smells our mood changing, you mm -hmm. know? Oh, the name of the colors used again to create that. You're going to have to go back and watch it. <laughs> she doesn't I remember which think, one she pulled out. <laughs> I think I can tell you. Well, I know it was this, uh -huh. burnt orange. Yes. I know it was this. Yes. The turquoise. I know I put in some gloss medium. Or and. And retarder? And retarder. Wow. Well, that's why I got that final last mm -hmm. nice print. Because if you don't add a little bit of this, but I will say, don't go heavy with this. Yeah. Don't go heavy with this. Because it, it does something to break down the paint. I can't explain it. Oh, yeah. The 12 by 12 is kind of new. Oh, yeah, it still smells like vanilla. <laughs> All right, now, we're going to keep our... Yes, vintage damask material, yes. Okay, so that those are the colors. And, and you saw, I just put out a little bit of each, but then I mixed it in, and, and that's you want to do that if you're using the retarder. I know I say that every time, but somebody will say, well, you didn't. Yeah, I did. I, I, I know I say that every single time because it's really important. Muy importante. Okay, what did I do with my print here? All so, right. paper puddles. Um, the, the key, I, I mean, there's lots of different things, and, and it, it's just so varied. Um, obviously, the, one of the main things that plays into a good image transfer is the actual image itself. Um, we've had the best luck with our printed, our laser printed 
black and white images, especially like our graphics, because we can they're a hundred percent. Now, if you're doing magazine transfers, there are just some magazines that do better than others. We've not played with that a ton. But then the other thing is, is that highly pigmented inks or inks, paints, paint, yes, work and best. Are really really high quality. Now, oh. Neats, Neatsa, mm -hmm. and she uses all kinds of paints. And uh, well, she's she's a pro. Like that, that that's her main gig. I mean, she she knows yeah. how to transfer an image. Yeah, that's just what she does, almost exclusively. But the thing about it is, is she, you know, by golly, she gets them every time, mm -hmm. and she uses color. She uses yeah, yada yada boo boo. All right, now we're getting there. All right, now we're going to employ our wonderful oh please tell me I didn't put that someplace else oh there it is I have all these stacked up here but the one that I'm after because it gives me the most Akiko's cat is helping her gel plate oh they're not usually very helpful the cats ours sure, certainly is an I'll tell you <laughs> but what. he's been on a real terror well, I, I think he, he's upset because we move things around. Yes. His little bed perch area has been yeah. moved along. All right. I'm putting those over yeah. there. I can't get them back on their, their home. Okay. Now. Okay. Here's our, here's our, this isn't exact. The background's a little bluer there. But I can tell you right now that I'm going to put this down with, and I'm going to use Depression, open with endanthrene. Okay? Provided I can find it. And then I'm going to pull, pull it with that print that we just did. Yes, they do. The high fashion, yes, lifestyle magazines do the best. Or you can make your own, do your own photos. That's, that's what I feel very comfortable doing. I don't feel comfortable using somebody else's yeah. stuff because I don't ever know where it's going to go. I don't. I might sell it or something. And then I have to worry about paying someone royalties and I don't want to do that. Word. I would like us to do more. We, we need to do a couple more photo shoot things and have some you know on, on hand when we want to play with that. Oh, us. I, I agree. I'd also like to have a professional photographer take our pictures at some point in time. I mean, we do an we do an all right job, but it, it would be nice to. I just want them to make me look good. It's part of their job. <laughs> they do the best they can. That's <laughs> what they're working with. That's Thanks, right. Mariah. That was nice. Okay, dokie. Now want... we want this to be opaque, so we're not going to worry about how much. And this is open. And this is, you know, it, it's, I, I know it seems kind of, what, obsessive to have to have colors in open and shut. Open and shut. <laughs> but in, in the long run, it really does. It really helps. And the reason I'm adding a little bit of this is because your Prussian blue has a tendency to be kind of greeny. This takes it over into the purple range. Really, really does. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I'm just gonna mix that with mine. Yeah, you, it's paint. It's not medium. And um, when you're going from, you know, I, I had heavy body, and then I had that fluid acrylic out there. You, you they they need a bit of swirling and. It, you you do need to do some violent mixing there because they're not naturally. Um, made for each other. Yeah. They're not um, friends. Not friends. But Hi, Miriam. Yes, can, time changed here. Mix them in. <laughs> I love that you, you are not doing the full 12. She, she's just not, she, she hasn't committed to the full 12. Top and oh, bottom. I don't need it. Your side to side. She, see, she can do 9 need, by 12. <laughs> I just need enough. I like the little, you know, extra that yeah. I can, you know. Go to the edge. A little, little, little outer. But but that's your zone. You're trained. 
Yes, that stencil isn't. That's the um, Peacock Swirls mm -hmm, by Darcy. It's, uh, yeah, this is totally a, a. I knew you would like this stencil. It's very Lisa. She could do some awesome things with this. Only one slight wrinkle there, and I got it ironed out. All right, nicely done. Is, we we want to get we want to get a good coverage on this, and I want to lift off. And this is one of the things when I was watching. Um, Elizabeth St. Hilaire. She has her her prints lined up, her background prints lined up. She I think she does she's got three ready to go. Mm -hmm. That's a really brilliant idea. And the reason is is because you don't want to be fumbling about the cabin yeah. trying to find something. When you're doing these layered up things. When you're doing these layered up things. Okay. Uh, I'm loving that. That looks fabulous. Let's go ahead and put this down, even though it is still, I mean, it's, I'm kind of putting blue on blue. No worries, Lisa. You need to take off and get some rest. No worries. Uh, for those of you that are coming in and haven't said hello in the chat, we would love to say hello back. If you want to hang out in the background, that's yes, totally fine, too. Give those thumbsies up on the video if you haven't. And you, you know, think that this is pretty cool and you like it. It's very helpful. We appreciate it. And if you're watching in the replay, if you'd leave a comment below, we love those. I love answering them. I love talking to you guys. I love telling P the funny things that you say. <laughs> and so you've actually been coming in and read because you said that you read some comments yeah, the other day. Yeah. I did. I, I'm just going and pulling as much off of this as I can because I want a really clean. Um, yeah, and actually, Sonia, in the in the current site, um, you don't have to do Google Pay. It, it, we have three different things. It's Google Pay, Pay PayPal, and um, just regular credit card processing. But yes, in the new website, there will be the the same thing. Basically, you will have all those options. It's just for whatever reason they made that Google Pay like so big and. You know, that isn't us. Like, that's the site builder. One of the reasons we're moving away from the site builder is that we can do more custom things. Okay, that's looking pretty good. Dynamic. <laughs> Gotta watch those little spots. And you see, this is deli paper. Deli paper is really good at um, <laughs> grabbing up stuff. Anytime you're using something that has been printed on and you have, you're going to have less absorption than if you have a paper surface there to grab it. See how much better that did? Hey, as, long, as long as you got money in the bank, Eddie. I, I think that, the, you know, the processing will go. What, what, what? He says, do you take debit cards? <laughs> says, yeah, that's all about having money in the bank. <laughs> You're right. welcome. You're welcome. And the reason I can do this is, you know, this piddly stuff I'm doing right now is because I have down... Retarder. There was retarder in the um, Prussian. Otherwise, it'd dry like that. That is very cool what you're doing. It's kind of like a, a rubbing. Like that's the look of it. Well, yeah, it kind of is because I just moved it around. <laughs> but this is going to be a simply wonderful um, overprint. Oh, yes, that's Froil, the, the dream big. She wrote that poem, and um, so we turned it into both a stamp and a stencil for her. And hopefully she'll be designing some more. The retarder is, um, what it does is it slows down the drying process of the paint. It, it, it slows it up. So, like, golden open paints have it built in to the paint. Yes. And that's, but, and, and that's and why it, I didn't have to use 
the, the clear retarder. Yeah. But for regular paints that are not necessarily open, or you know that they're going to dry very quickly, you can buy retarder and add it in. One of the things to keep in mind about that is that whenever you're mixing it up, you either want to do that off of your plate, or like what P was doing with the knife, is making sure that it's really mixed up well. Because if you hit just the, the medium, and, and that's true of either in like matte medium, so like if you wanted to make something more glossy or anything like that, it creates a bald spot, which I think was such a brilliant way to describe that, it does. on your brayer and on the plate. And that's 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 absolutely the truth. Mm -hmm. Did you all see this? Now, we've from that one thing, we've managed to get three different pulls. Actually, four. One, two, three, four. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Because remember, we took it off on this. But the reason this pulls so well is number one, this tissue paper is colored with the spray. And as Diane said, that is a very good point. She uses Golden Open a lot for the more complex prints. Absolutely. You get the layering, you have time to layer it, you have time to make decisions about it. Now, now here's the downside. Okay. <laughs> but here, here, here's, how, here's how you take care of this you use a really, uh, oh. You either pull it onto something. Or you leave it on the plate and let it dry for yeah, hours. Yeah, four hours. <laughs> we, we don't have three or four hours. So what we're going to do here is we're, we're going oh, to Oh, show them the package, or the, the, the tube of the retarder. Oh. The one we like is U.S. Art Supply. Uh, other brands have retarders as well. Um, they even might call them extenders, I believe. I, I think. I, I, and we I, have that I, discussion I, at one point. Yeah, remember we, we tried to find some from Golden, but Golden doesn't call it that. They call it... Um, I thought it was extender. Slow dry. Slow dry. Slow dry. And I I don't know. I just... Um, is I, that what that is? Yeah, this is C slow dry. Mm -hmm. Gel additive. Oh, that's Liquitex. Yes, this is Liquitex. I'm sorry. Golden also makes one. Yeah. But price point wise, the U.S. Art Supply acrylic paint retarder. It's way to go. I have used this since we started using it and really um, and this is certainly a lot more directions. For acrylic colors and mediums only. Binder free. Okay. The binder is what keeps your paint pulled mm -hmm. together. Okay. Don't add more than 25% by volume or mix with other Additives. Well, I don't know what they're talking about. Other additives. I don't well, know this is means. like when you get all weird sciencey, and then we end up with something that never, never actually dries. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like tar gel. Like tar gel. I I love tar gel, and I love the way it looks, but it does take it takes weeks to dry. Mm -hmm. Slow drying time and increases thickness. So if you have a really Hi, thin, uh, whatever you can, but I, I'm not. Yeah. I have this. I, I don't use it. I just use this stuff right here. Because this is the bomb diggity. <laughs> okay. So. It's got price and function. Absolutely. We're going to pull this, and we're going to pull it. With, and it, it's, it's, it's wet, so it's not going to stay. I, I won't see this. Yeah. Um, I want something in this room. Just because I don't have anything. And I really, I love, I'm in love with this color. Okay, what else do we want? To put oh, sure, sure, sure. That, <laughs> thank you, Candy's always, she's, she's such a good reminder on the, yeah, Let, let's give, give us an affiliate link for that. Sparkle it up a little bit as... Gail will be happy I'm doing this. <laughs> you feel Gayla's the one? <laughs> Gayla's, is, she's always saying that. Add some gold or add some. Yes. I think it's Gayla. I don't know. I, I, I know. Um, oh, they changed their packaging a little bit. I, I like it. Okay, so we're getting... We're getting some of the color from the um, previous, and some of the design is coming loose, and some some is not so much. But isn't that an absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous, wonderful, marvelous? It's 
just used poopy pieces of already. Oh, hh hey, no worries. And this Thanks, is, Diane. You can tell this is gel deli paper because of the serrated edge. Really give it a good, you know. And you've noticed I don't use my barren so much when I'm doing the tissue paper. Now look at that. What was the color of the Amsterdam paint? Oh, that's lovely. Um, oh, sorry. I thought I held it up. Probably did, but didn't leave it. Well, you can't read that. Permanent, <laughs> permanent red violet. Number? Uh, five, six, seven. There you go. And it says it's totally transparent. I don't know that I would necessarily say yeah. that. See that? But the standard series seem to be more transparent yes. than the expert. Yes. Like you'll find more opaques in the expert. Now remember, I mixed a little bit of the interference gold with this to kind of pump it up. Pump it up and make it a little more. And I I needed this purple background because, well, I'll bring it back and show you what I'm talking about because I noticed I don't have a lot of purples in my um, but I do I do have the pocket pages that are purple yeah purple pocket pages but look at that purple right there mmm yep and look at that lovely well done and in your stars there oh that's true but I just think the back of this now what I'm thinking of doing here is stamping this yes rather than doing... Uh, Can we do that during the stream today? Oh, absolutely. We'll just wait till that dries. And I've got another one I need to stamp. Fantastic. So I think that we've got our papers over here. Yay! I think that either there is something that I could use. Ooh, I don't want to do that. And you know, I've still got this one. Do you remember how we did this one? I think this is absolutely... <laughs> Thank you, Judy. The most gorgeous paper ever. And I just feel like I must use it. <laughs> It's been a lot that went into that thing. Yes. And I'm trying to get these all loosened up here so they're not sticking to each other. Or the stencil. Now the other thing you can do with that stencil, and this is what Elizabeth St. Hilaire does. She switches them around. Flip flops it. Flip, you know, if the top is up here, then she puts that down mm -hmm. at the bottom. And then she wrote, gives it one rotation, so not only that, but she's got the side to side. Oh, yes. And so you, you are most welcome. It is a, a lovely, lovely stencil. So Christy Hartman, she's also one of our designers. She's the designer of the Celestial Gateway, which is the, you know, door looking. The arch. Yes. Um, which is also available in the shop. They These just go so well together, I think. But I'll tell you what. You know, you don't have to match things up. But sometimes you just feel a, Welcome, an affinity with one another. Now, I don't know who does these. Paula. Those are the prayer wheels. Yes. Rune blocks and prayer wheels. Rune also, blocks and Also, fantastic prayer. stencils. Absolutely. Do we that. don't carry bad stencils. <laughs> we don't? No. Where did I get this? No, I said we don't carry bad stencils in our shop. Oh, heavens no. Everything's never... fabulous. Now, yes. And <laughs> Some of them might have okay. needed a little rework or whatever. I, I know this is really putting Mariah on, on the spot, but Diane Bell has some stamps. I saw them. She has this one little stamp, and it's dancers. And they're all doing, you know, different different things. I was wondering if she would like to... Um, well, did she make them? Like, are they yes. hers, hers? Yes, she made them. I think she needs to submit those for inclusion. And, and I, 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 But I really like those dancers. I would really use D those Diane? dancers. Diane, what say ye? You don't have to answer in the chat. You can reach out to me. You can also just tell us to bugger off, so. Yeah, and our feelings won't be <laughs> no, hurt. No, not but, at all. <laughs> you know. We understand. There are certain things that P's like, um, we're not making this into anything. This is mine. 
I usually talk her out of it, but yes, I don't have anything. Well, I do. There are a couple of things, but that... they're they're really the reason they aren't made of stamps is because they're not all that good. <laughs> um, Mariah just doesn't tell me that she's being very sweet and kind. And okay, well, let's get with this stamping business. <laughs> My shoulder's feeling pretty good. This side's now the. I told Mariah, I said, you know, usually I just have this one shoulder that hurts all the time because I'm s stamping and rolling and whatnot. <laughs> but now, I mean, I've been doing some heavy lifting. I've been Friends? getting up and down off the floor. Hey, you need to watch Fran's last um, stream from Friday because she has some pretty cool stamps, too. I meant to, I was working on orders and everything. I meant to say something to her about that. And, and yes, I, I think that. You know, whatever Fran's willing to send our way. Right now, it's just, again, the big focus is getting this website done. And then we can talk about, you know, adding more awesome things. We just, it was getting to the point where it's like, okay, we, we can't keep putting things in <laughs> to this shop that we know is going to go away. <laughs> because it's like, we just know that that's mu that much more work to put back into the newer site. And let me tell you, it's going to okay, quite some work. It. Yes. Her, her, her stamps were awesome. Yes. Look at this. I just reached right over there and got it. <laughs> we're very proud of you. We're, we are. We're so close. We are so close. And I told her I all We have a bottle of champagne out in that fridge that's been there for about three or four years. Uh, oh, we well, may be busting that thing it, open. It, it, it just gets well up to a point. It may be turned into vinegar, but we'll just make salad. <laughs> With our champagne. <laughs> champagne vinegar. I mean, they yeah. actually have... Alright, now is that the one I want to use? Or do I want to use the purpley or one? Ah, oh, let's use them both. Yeah, I said use them both. Yeah. Now, because this is transparent, sort of, we can try... Oh, D Diane was in the restroom. She was pardoned? Oh, you have some stamps that P really loves, some dancing ladies or something like that. If you created those, if indeed they are yours, are you interested in us selling them in the shop? And if you are, you don't have to answer here or not. Just reach out to me, Diane. <laughs> I love the star stamp. That was one of my big requests. I know it's not like, you know, super artsy, but... Hey, you know what? It's Some of the... It, very it's functional. Like underwear. Yeah. <laughs> the I hate <laughs> buying it because it's not sexy. And Well, I guess you can. God knows I was yeah. born in that kind of stuff for years. Um, <laughs> Mariah used to buy those bras that were all fancy and whatever and turn them wrong side out because the other side felt itchy. better. <laughs> Yeah, when they made, um, put all that nice satiny stuff on the, the part that, you know, on Next now. to your skin. And, <laughs> I always found that God. amusing. Oh. I, I think that, no, the way to look at the star stamp is that it's, it's like. It's, it's pretty, it's, it's pretty idiot proof. I mean, you don't have to. <laughs> it's also very user friendly. Oh, yeah that too yeah and even if you kind of get over a little bit it, it, it's very forgiving the placement of the stars oh she says yeah see they were she created them from illustrations ah uh, so we wouldn't be able to do yeah. that well P liked them very much I did <laughs> Makes them kind now of sad. that being said I, I'll give a little you know Paula Kane one of our other designers who's here has these dancing kind of swimming ladies all these characters that are kind of um you know they're in silhouette right and some of them are a little chunkier which i think is fabulous mm -hmm. i think they would make awesome stamps and yeah. be lots of fun to play with um they're 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 masks as well I just haven't gotten to it yet yeah well i think the, the, what really appealed to me about the ones that i saw on Di that diane had um were they had such movement plus each body interacted with the one next to it and kind of you know went into the positive negative kind mm -hmm. of thing i think you could do that with paula stuff yeah the upo people she calls them the upo people the upo people 
Yeah, she's got swimmers and then she's got dancers. But I kind of want it about this size. See, and that's better in a stamp. Because this now some of I, I, I have trouble stamping with this bigger stamps. Number one, you have trouble inking them up. And I, I know that you can, but just I'm just speaking mm -hmm. for me personally. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, now we're going to let this one dry while we bring in the other one that we were going to do, if I can find it. Yes, we are. She's she's right there across from me. That's why I look over that way. <laughs> okay, so remember we we're gonna, we we're going to amp this up a little bit. And I think what I'm going to use is I'm going to use the more purpley one. Oh, Paula's going to make her, her rounder lady swimmers doing yoga next time. Oh, wow. Well, there you go. Some, some fluffy yoga. <laughs> so see, when you stamp over the top of those ones that are below it, <laughs> they slightly interfere. But whatever. It's just, I think it's really... And this is the Twilight. It's not quite as juicy. Hi, Susie. But what I need to do is I need to add a little bit more of my um, re-inker mm -hmm. that's not this color. <laughs> she like just mixes this. it up. Notice my rhythm I have for Yes, you do. It's very nice. And the thing is, is like, because we do have the stencil, but you wouldn't be able to get the same look. No. And the thing about the, the stencil is, I really, I really like it when I'm starting. Yeah, it's but a... This is a finisher. This is an option that you have. Stars you, to start and finish with. Yes. Stencils to stamp. Because <laughs> one of these is done on the back side <laughs> before I That's the pulled beat. it with the, um, and I can tell because this is Naples yellow. Yeah. Which has a really nice, you know, if you want your gold to be a little more opaque and a little bit more have more surface more mirror mirror beat. then you need to use a light color behind it if you want to dull it down and have it a little less shiny gold you use like a red or dark green or whatever if you want to turn your gold to copper use red mm -hmm. yeah and use opaque red don't use the yeah okay this is this needs to dry because it's coming off on my fingers but once this stuff is dry, it is going to be absolutely all wonderful. about the layers. Definitely. Okay, now. Oh, look at those little stars on the edge there. Aren't those cute? <laughs> Put that over there because that's probably going to be one of my. All right, let's get our book back here and make some decisions. I made those stars. <laughs> They're not terribly. I mean, it's just a little disc and you turn it and. You know, that, that's not any. No, it's not, but it's just, you know. I, it's, it's good design. It is, and <laughs> I use, well, obviously, I, I use it a lot. I love pushing stencil butter through these. The only thing about the stencil butter when you're doing it, you want to make sure that you always have your heel down. That little point right there Oops. has a tendency, if, you, if you're going like this, it'll slip under. Mm -hmm. So, it's actually better to use um, the dull one than I, I, that doesn't have a, or your credit card, because mm -hmm. it's easy to get flipped up on, on the mm -hmm. points. Yeah. Well, and and it also helps if you're doing it on your gel plate, and before you do any kind of butter or anything, you take your brayer and make sure that it's attached to the gel plate really s Now, you know, that's one of the reasons that... On these designs that have a lot of intricate, um, well, either it's really open, so so even though this is a small pattern, there's some, there's large open, like meaning, not all the 
points that come in are connected to something else. So yeah. you have lift. Like this right here. And this is why swirls are very hard. <laughs> because, if yes, they're lovely and awesome. They're very difficult to cut on the machines that we have because it's yeah. just corkscrews. <laughs> And they're they, good pouncers. They're good pouncers. <laughs> but if not you don't, so much scraping over. Exactly. You flip them up and, yep. you, you know, you yep. got to start over. And, yeah. yeah that, they're nobody, hooky bits. Nobody wants to do that. That isn't fun. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, talked about that. So, we really, at this point, we can make these happen. Hi, Gretchen. Any, we can make anything happen there that we want to happen. All right? Mm -hmm. What we're concerned about now is our new pages. Okay, and we want our new pages to look like they belong here. It doesn't mean that they have to be, you know, miss matchy matchy. I, I'm, you know, I'm not about that. And you can see, okay, that and by the time I round that off, I think that's going to be lovely. And by the time I round this off, this is going to be lovely. I just want to make sure. I'll probably go towards the top of that. But that's what I'm gauging here is where those little tabs are that I can sew to. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, here's my question. Uh, well, you need to get some papers down on that panel. Yes. We then need to, do you want, um, do you want the zutter type punch on there? Or do you just want a hole puncher? I'm thinking, oh, I never thought about the zutter thing. The zutter punch? The Zutter Punch. Because that's kind of a squared off it is. affair. It also makes my life a lot easier. But I hope that I don't screw it up because sometimes I do. <laughs> I know. It's like that. It gets a little wonky. Um, the reason I'm going with the round, the one, one thing is because remember I want to do the lacing. And I don't think that the lacing will work as well with the, um, uh, my, my, uh, and you know, I haven't tried this. I guess I should. Yeah. But, and what I want to use is I want to use this cording. That seems a bit much. That seems a little heavy. Her and this darn cording. <laughs> she snatched it out of my hands the other day because it's like, where does this go? She's just give it to me. <laughs> Because it was mixed in with some things that it was not you supposed to You can tell. Look at this. <laughs> is that the cat? That looks like chew marks. It is chew marks. That's the cat. He likes to chew it paper. Used to, yeah. It used to, look at that. <laughs> little burger. Set on, and you can tell it's, it's, it's got a little. Oh. Oh, it must be temper paint or, or it, it was. pastel. Mm -hmm. Whatever. Whatever. Yeah, this is it's fine. Hi, Barbara. But I want to lace this Carol. because then, and the reason I want it a little bit on the heavy side is, uh -huh. I'm going to be attaching it to these things. And if I use... I feel it's a bit over... Well, you can just feel that way, and I, I, I appreciate you... Respect that, but also... Bringing that up. Respectfully decline. Uh, respectfully decline. <laughs> and And... You know, y'all are... Ooh. Hey. See, it's like your camera... Like, when I get the camera in the perfect position, these darn brushes... I gotta figure out something. I gotta figure out something. Yeah, there. Look at... The lighting got better. And then it goes back. It Stop moving. I don't, now I, you're all in the dark. I'm in the dark? <laughs> well, that's probably because something's in the way. I don't know. There we go. All right. So, I just feel like that this is the way to go. And I really think I want I want the, the hole to be punched rather f far in. Okay, here's the next question. Do you want the hole puncher one, or do you want me to go down and get the... Because I'm assuming I'm the puncher. Well, you've got to match it up. I will. I will make little marks where every hole goes. Oh goodness, lady, that makes it tricky. But okay, we hey, can do that. Hey, you know what? We don't even have to use that fancy thing you've got. I can use this no. old. Oh no, here. You don't want to use that one because that one's hard. Old one. Here, and this one's nice because you can slide it back in it if you want it further in. 
that's the beauty of this one. But that's why I was asking if you wanted a bigger hole, then that, that, that's your tool right there. But then I have the belt punch that will do those smaller holes. It's just a little trickier, especially like lining it up to... No, I think I need bigger holes because it's the there thread's go. got to go through the hole twice. Yeah, and I think you can even punch that because it's it's a nice... I love these crocodile tools. They're... they're we are well, memory keeper I things. Yeah, it is. Fantastic. Oh, yeah. I mean, this thing should be fired and melted down to, you know, something else. All right. Now, you said it... it, it oh, well, it just goes in. No, it, it'll slide out some if you want. Yeah. Oh, holy moly. Yeah. So I could, I could make it so that this is going to lock in and go to the same place each time. I yes. love it. Fantastic. I That's know. exactly we, we what just gave I need. Them a most but I don't really think I'm ready for that. Okay. I think I want to cover first. We, we just gave them a most and, brilliant little commercial there. And whole later. <laughs> we are memory creepers if you're watching. All right. Send us some I'll free stuff. I'll tell you stuff. what. On twe tweakers, I promise I will have at least one of these either done or I will just do a sample and show you what I have in mind. But we gave it a good talk through. Yeah. Are you gonna? Are you gonna? Um, and this is this is. Um, you need to glue down some of your papers on that panel. And see, I need to check this and see if it's. I have one that's synthetic and I have one that is natural. I like the synthetic better because you can burn the edges and it. Yeah, yeah. and it doesn't because see it, it gets pretty fluffy there. Yeah. But I've had this forever and ever and ever. Hey, Peg. Glad you're here. It's, it, it's, it's from the macrame days, so it's probably 25 years old. It's probably older than that. Probably. Because if it, I, I don't ever remember you macrameing, so that was, you know, before mm. me. I was actually mac macrame while I was breastfeeding you. Oh, okay. Well, it was sort of during I me. had a pouch thing that I'd put on you, and I could macrame, and you would nurse. And look at me. <laughs> oh, oh, fun God. times. All right, we got a bit of warpage going on here, but we're not worried about that. We know how to counteract that. Well, yeah, and remember, just, I just glued the back on Because these all look just exactly like that. Yeah. But, you know, they all get flattened. It has out. fresh glue. Fresh glue. Wet glue. All right. So here's the side. Okay, this, this is how it's going to open up. So this needs to kind of somehow or other have a relationship to this page. Mm -hmm. This is what I was talking about when I said, you know, when we're doing all these pages with the, um, mm -hmm. the blue on it. Okay, I love that. Yes. Love that. Now, but now that's not the one that you were going to do the, with your stars, right? Mm hmm. That's not the one that you were going to do with the stars, right? No. Okay. That would be... That will have to be the other side. Okay? This is the blue side. Okay. And I think I'm going to... What I'm going to do with this side is I'm going to um, use... And and uh, do this and this. Uh, will the retarder remove the shine from metallics? Not typically. I, I don't think that we've noticed that. Usually... Um, I haven't. I think it's... You know, it's really not matte and it's really not gloss. It's... I, I don't know how to say it. It really doesn't do anything. And it mixes in versus like... So, you know, when you put matte medium on top of something, then it coats it. Yes. Where this is getting mixed in and it it, it seems to bind well and, and not mess with the color much. Not to say that it doesn't, because I'm sure somebody will come back and be like, oh, you're very wrong. Um, it happens. Um, but yeah, I think overall, that has not been something like we're like, whoa, I've dulled out. Yeah. Okay, um, I wanted another... Let's see, here we go again. Okay. I'm going to, because I really it's like... R R Rhonda, Rhonda put it in all caps for me with the question mark. See, that's the nice thing about having those emojis. And yes, if you have a super question, that's that's the way to do it. Right there. Yeah, yeah. Right there. Right there. Right there. Okay. I really want... I want the scale of the smaller... Um... this. <laughs> so I'm going to have to do a little bit more gel printing. I know you all hate it when that happens. 
I think this one over here is going to be splendid. And remember, I'm going to have a strip of of stars. Boy, you've been a little rough with that stencil there. What do you mean? Like got some poppy epic parts. Oh yeah, I had oh. I have some broken parts. You've not been treating your stencil nicely. Well, I had I, I used it, um what did I use it with? But I noticed I was starting to get clogged up. Oh, on yeah. these little things mm -hmm. right there. And you went scrubby on it, didn't you? And I went scrubby on it, so yeah. I'm kinda yeah, oh, I see that. Sorry, little stencil. They are sturdy, but you know. Well, you can just bend them back. Yeah. And, and I will say one of the other things, if you guys do have stencils that get warped, bent, anything like that, leave them somewhere where it's kind of warm and they will even out. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah. not hot, hot. They will this, melt. This will be, this will be fine. <laughs> but warm. <laughs> Take them into the shower with you, you yeah. know, into the bathroom. <laughs> All right. So this is going to be the torn part. Like, mm -hmm. remember the other stars? Well, this is going to be the torn part but I need another I've got this one I want to use this one but I need to have another one because I'm going to use two over here these two yeah a lot in that and then I'm going to have to do some printing here to get this into it doesn't have to match that by any right. means I don't care about that but I do want it to, to sort of go with this one. Yeah. Because this is going to be the other. And it's going to show more because this is a bigger bigger panel. Alright, so what do, you, what do you want to do there? Uh, this needs to be, I need to gel print this. Okay. And remember the purple stars, which we're not finished with yet. Uh, yes, the Zutter holes use O-wires in different diameters. That is correct. But she, she ixnayed the, the Zutter. No, I don't want to use that because I'm going to. Well, that's what I think. I don't know yet. I've got to practice and play with it. This is going to be on the other side mm -hmm. of the door and go with. Okay, I can I can do this. This. And. this. I don't know if I really, I, I'm not absolutely loving that. No, I think. I love it with this, but I don't necessarily love it with this. No, I think if you want it to blend more, you need to put a glaze over it that with, is. It's more blue. And, and No, I wasn't going to go that route. I was actually going to say you need to like warm it up with a, you know, salmon-y color. Um, well. Or go. Go completely. But I think taking it over to a greeny, bluey thing is going to be much harder than hitting the salmon it certainly is. area. Plus your stars might kind of hit that. Okay, well that is a decision that we, we don't necessarily need to make. And we might not even use that. We don't have to. We've got options. We've got options. Alright, let's get this out of here. Because we need this. Don't need my stamps. <laughs> and this is this is how I end up with messes. Because then I'm all oops, I have stars in my hand. <laughs> you do. You've been marked with the star. Okay, let's get on with it here. All right, you got 20 minutes. Oh dear, really? Yeah, you've been let's looking at prints. Time flies. <laughs> Let's see what we've got here. We'll just pull some stuff that's been on there for, I don't know, since the last time I was here. Yeah, she hasn't been arting so much because she's, you know, getting her, her room ready. And then we decided that she said that she's okay with once she has her bedroom done. And maybe if we can clean up the studio a bit, we could do a tour of her room to the studio. Yeah, we won't show you all of the studio, just the parts that look nice. Oh, well, it's hard not to see the whole thing. Like, I think if, if we show it, we show it. Okay. Well, let's at least try to get the cart cleaned up. Yes, please. I would like that to actually be gone, because it needs... We're, we're going to tackle this at some point. 
Now, I don't know what you think we're going to do with all the stuff that's on the car. I am amazing. She is just truly. Look at those little bird dropping things out there. Aren't they wonderful? <laughs> it's not it's actually like a little, little bird hopped around and pooped once or twice and stepped in it. <laughs> or bird holes. Kept, kept hopping. <laughs> Oh, uh, some people worry about that paper rolling up like that, and I, I don't understand that. Of course, it's going to roll up like that. See, it's funny because we hit like the generations. It, it, like a lot of you guys are right around P's age, and then there's a good group of you guys that are around my age. Yeah, I'm gonna have a little swig of coffee. Multi generational. Mm hmm. We haven't we haven't really brought any new kids you know some kids kids in but that's all right yeah oh, i've got my plate here i don't know what i'm doing all right here, they're out doing me. things those younger people I, I, <laughs> <laughs> they're not sitting at home crafting <laughs> well give them time uh -huh. all right this is just because i i would really like this to pull as a nice little print and i'm using the bigger even though I, I have a smaller stencil here. This is one of the things that I, I don't I don't know, but I, I'm going to make the request and I'll probably get smacked down. I'll see Kirsten your I, I was born in 77. See Kirsten, Eddie, and Sharon are like in my in the we were all born in like, you know, from your young in the seventies. Youngsters. Yes. I would like this scale in large form. Okay. Can it happen? It can happen. Excellent. I think. I think. It, I think it would save me a lot of 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 um. Yes, hassle here. I'm gonna have to. I have to piece that together, but yeah, I think I can. Ha I can make that happen. Unless Darcy, you want to take a crack at it? Now I could use <laughs> Darcy. I could use this one. Are you feeling better? Which is different. But I still, you know, I don't know. Maybe I'll go ahead and, we got 20 minutes, right? I, I don't have to. Aw, thanks, Kirsten. I don't have to get this right the first time, right? I've got time to. I've got my makeup out. on. Okay, we're going to go ahead. Yeah, see, Judy P, she's right there kind of, you know, she's 67. Yeah. Okay, so what do we want to happen here? We want... Oh, goodness, Sophie, it, she was born in the 80s. All right, you are. You're our baby. Sophie's our baby. She was born in 83. Oh, my goodness. I know. Izzy has a little friend that's named Sophie at school. Yeah. She tells she... us about Sophie. Mm -hmm. Is that the right sign? I'm just about lost. My All right, Darcy's going to take a crack at it. Um, I can't remember. Do you have Photoshop, Darcy? I can talk you through it. I'm probably kind of one of the easier ways to, to come at it. All right. So this is this is regular Prussian blue. No open. Because we want to go fast here. Yeah. But you do need a little bit more because you're going down into the... And we're going to do a flippy do. Mm -hmm. I have the hardest time getting paint lids on. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so like words. March of hard. Oh, uh, Fran says that she thinks her Zutter, the, the Zutter, I, I think my Zutter idea would go great with the wide eyelet piece. Thanks, PM, for the inspiration. Well, you're welcome, Fran. Oh, you man. Inspire we us all we the are time. here to inspire. <laughs> that is what I live and breathe for. <laughs> and making me crazy. <laughs> but Mariah tells Izzy, <laughs> I am here to serve you. Of course, she means it sarcastically. When that child starts understanding sarcasm, we're all in deep doo-doo. <laughs> because she's already kind of smart-mouthy. I, I, I don't know what she's been watching in Popsy's room, but it ain't good. No. But yeah, not, our, none of us really <laughs> not, like, are willing to... Okay, yeah, so here's the... Here's the no, it's it's not bad, but it's, it's not great. It's just stupid, tr you know, the people doing tricks and... They kind of fill in their house with, you know, play balls and it's just it, it's it's nonsense. Yeah. <laughs> she loves nonsense. She does. 
she oh. just revels in it. And I could just hear her. She oh, laughs she, from the bottom of her stomach. You can hear her in the entire house. I mean, she cracks up. And I'm just like, I don't know if you guys know a movie called Idiocracy. But there's a show on that that they, you know, it's like one of the biggest, it's called Out My Balls. Yeah, that's kind of the thing. By the way, Idiocracy is one of my most favorite All right, shows. well, we can't linger about here all day if we want to get that other print off there because I didn't use any retarder. But you can see we're starting to get into the ballpark there. And I, I can I can make that work. I oh. can make that work. Where's <laughs> another one that I need to put something onto? Not that. See, you keep these... these um, <laughs> It is cool that we have so many people. So I think we figured out that, oh, Carla's an 80s baby as well. But um, Ricky Nordmeyer is born in 1945. And Jeanette is 1949. Oh, see, I'm 51. Mm -hmm. It's Susan Dufresne's 53. But, you know, right there in the, we, we've got our little pockets for sure. All right, uh, this this is going to require a bit of the sitting, and we don't really care because we're yeah, not. Yeah, and I knew Darcy. Yeah, Darcy's kind of in, in, in my in our little seventies group. <laughs> oh, we have another. Oh, Marsha Markle's nineteen forty four. Oh, All right. She's our she's our what do you call it Ma matriarch? The the yeah like yeah. You're in charge, Marsha. Let us know. <laughs> well, somebody's in. Or did we have 43? Was Ricky 43 or was she? Wait, hold on. I thought 53. See, I'm trying to pull with my other hand so that my one shoulder doesn't all get all <laughs> wonky. Okay, yeah. Ricky was uh, 45 and Marsh is 44. Well, I just kept telling Mariah, I said, you know, as we were in all these other groups and all these other young whippersnappers, <laughs> whippersnappers. <laughs> whipping out stuff right and left and, you know, being very. Hey, you know what? Somebody the other day, and actually a few people have said, and, and I love it, like you guys that are our, our YouTuber crowd, our, our YouTuber friends that talk about the group. I mean, it warms my heart every time you do because I one of the things that I hear over and over and over again is that how diverse our group is, how interesting and how eclectic, eclectic and lovey we all are too. It, it's not just about posting. And, and that's exactly what we wanted. Like we were purposeful about that. And that's one of the reasons I have people watch the little video when they first come in, because I, I want those expectations to be, you know, seen and heard right there from the get go, because that is very important because that's something that we weren't getting elsewhere. Anywhere else. It was just, I just would get so discouraged because I didn't feel like anybody had the vision that I was having that, or was accepting the idea that we could all be different and it was still okay. The yeah. people at the, on the alcohol ink thing were angry with me because I would say, have you done this? Have you done this? And I mean, it was like shut down. No. No, we want to do this the and same way, but we've always this, done it. You do it this way. And, it's and like, this is oh, how whoa, we do it. all right. And I'm like, well, boy, am I in the wrong place. I mean, because <laughs> we were going to mix our I did. I alcohol just... inks with, you know, tar gel and let that stuff, you know, <laughs> never dry. <laughs> but by golly, as once it did. <laughs> I don't think some of that still oh, ever dry. We it covered is. it with paper. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's uh, let's do let's do a little bit of really exciting mixing here. Mm -hmm. All right, I want. I want to get a color of green mm -hmm. that's really not, yeah. it, the, the color that I'm aiming for here is kind of this out here where it's sort of darkish green, uh -huh. but I don't want everything to go away here. So what I'm going to have to do here is I'm going to have to, I'm going to put down some of this purple and let me tell you what, this stuff is some Thank you, major coverage. Let me show you here on the. You don't see any stripes through that stuff. It, it, it's heavy duty. 
And let's see. Oh, perfect. Fran's going to show the Zutter in her stream tomorrow. So you guys check that out. Now, you'll be staying. Okay, this is going to get complicated. I have a question. So Fran is in the UK and normally in Texas here, Central Time, she comes on at 1. The time ch has changed. What does that mean? Yes, please. Are we going backwards or Can forwards? Or are we staying at the same? Somebody address that, please. please. Violet. Because I know Fran will be like, I don't know. Same time as I always do in the UK. <laughs> Violet, help us. Help us, please. My All right. Poor so we're, brain this is where we're bringing that. in our acrylic medium gloss gel. And we're going to lighten this up transparency-wise. Yeah. Uh, hopefully a lot. Yeah, it looks like it. I hope too. Yes. At that. Look, that, that, that. All right, let's see what we've got. Yeah. Yeah, because I think theirs doesn't change for another, towards the end of the month. Now, remember the gloss medium, you can mix as much with, of that as you want to with it because it, it's paint. It's the, retarder that you you can't do that with oh see uh oh it means i'm confused exactly friend yeah join the join, <sighs> join the join okay join so the let, let, let me let me talk through this for a second so i think you usually go on at 7 p.m your time right friend which is 1 p.m our time okay a little bit more i feel like that. probably what's gonna happen is that it's noon. It's either noon or two. <laughs> well, gee. Central time. <laughs> that's, that's, that's really close. You could either get there on time or miss the whole thing. You're going to overshoot or under. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh. In noon. Okay, yeah, that's kind of what I was feeling. See, Gretchen said two. <laughs> Darcy said noon. <laughs> I don't think we're helping. <laughs> I think we're just muddy in the waters. As well. You know, just watch in the afternoon. If you're in the States, in the United States of America, <laughs> you, you're going to want to hang out on YouTube in the afternoon and watch for friends. <laughs> Hopefully, Violet will clear this all up and do a lovely post in Makers. <laughs> so be sure to watch for that. <laughs> It's so sad that one hour really just <laughs> mucks it up for all of us, doesn't Gives it? Gives everybody a... <laughs> I'll I, I tell you what, I, I, I think that those... I don't know who thought that up, and I know uh -huh. I understand it as a concept. Yeah, but it's terrible. It, it's just an awful idea. Yes, make sure you have your all right, notifications. Now we have, oh, yeah. goodness. I have a lot of paint down here because I was mixing, and you all know what happens when I mix paint. I end up with... Yeah. Gallons of it. But we're getting some good, you know, stuff that we mm -hmm. can use. I, I just, I don't ever disparage the fact that, you know, I have, I can send them on to you all. <laughs> I can. Exactly, Jeanette. She says, we've all lost sleep. That's the other problem. <laughs> we're trying to figure this out. We have less sleep because. You know, you want to stay up late, but then I was like, ah, oh, I really well, need to go to bed. A little bit in the Miami Vice mm -hmm. range there. But we know how to tone that down. Let's go ahead and get some more off here. See, this is why I do this, because it comes through the uh, tissue uh, yeah. paper. And dabbing actually works better than rubbing. Because the dabbiness, you, you get that pushing down in the okay. the cracks business. And the other thing that, you know, I need to keep in mind here is I need papers to cover my boxes with. Mm. Yes, you still have some boxes to do. I do. I am loving that one on the end. Oh, because she, she has a little system where she takes her vitamins and things. And and see, and I haven't the, taken them today. Yeah, I was going to say, I don't see the rabbit. <laughs> so that means I have not taken my vitamins today. But I usually try to take them with food because they kind of do upset my stomach. But you know what? 
fan sister Nikki. She's so <coughs> smart. She's she she knows all kinds of of things. She lived in China for five years, and um, her daughter spoke fluent Chinese coming back to the United States, and it took her a little while to. Okay, now do we want to do that? Yeah, why not? Yes, thank you, Fran. But she is into alternative medicines and that kind of stuff. But she found these vitamins that you put on, and they're like little, A little patches. Patch. Like, you know, nicotine patches and that kind of stuff? Little patches. She, and the thing about them is that they're much more... Um, like you're actually absorbing it. Yes. It's not going through your stomach. Because a lot of times they just pass through. Yeah, you just poop them out and, or pee them out. <laughs> I, I mean, all true. streams lead to this at some point in time. I mean, we we have been right is, under the wire here with five minutes left in the stream, like but you know, kindergarten. They're always talking about bodily functions. <laughs> that, you know. Yes. Oh goodness. Now see, even that is quite. I mean, it's faint, but we we can put so many more layers mm -hmm. on there. That. Oh, yes. And yeah. I've got to use this Good paint. Quality. I'm sorry. It's just killing me that I, I would not use this. Transdermal. Transdermal. Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, I love these nursey people. Mm hmm We love some good nurse, nurse tech terminology. Okay, we're just going to go ahead and pick this up with this. I got a few wrinkles, but good enough. Oh, I feel good about, you know, using that paint that was on my brayer. Ah. <laughs> Loverly. <laughs> Loverly. Oh, that, that, that was funny, Fran. That was what? funny. Well, so I'm going to read it out. You guys put it in the chat. There's always a chance that I'm going to read it now. Some of the stuff I just leave in the chat. But this is a good one. It's funny. It made me chuckle. Uh, so Fran and Sharon are having a little conversation. Um, and so Sharon is going to have to wear a bra today for a road trip. And then Fran <coughs> said to her, hey, Sharon, are you going somewhere as Princess Leia? <laughs> I, I don't get it. It's like she's going to put the bra on her head. <laughs> See, I had to explain it to her, but that's all right. Oh, my gosh. That is... She says bra is more comfy on your head. <laughs> Somebody, it's, it's kind of like the doctor asked me when my last checkup was, and I just didn't answer for, you know. Like, and I was in there with it, I was like, I, it was really good that I was, because there was a little tense moment. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> okay, let's see here. A little bit of this, and a little bit of that. Am I still on? You, you're still on. I'm giving you all the way up to the very last moment. Now, I will say this. To those of you that have come in, um... Do say hello in the chat. I mean, we're still live right now. If you're watching this on replay, apologies um, that, that you missed the chat. We, we do love it when you guys come and hang out with us live, but understand that, you know, some of you get here for the replay. That's cool, too. Leave comments down below, and those of you that are here and want to come back and leave comments, we also very much appreciate those. If you want to hang out with us more along with our lovely awesome people here in the chat just like we were talking about earlier that's over in the makers of mixed media art and artists facebook group you can please answer the questions we want to know a little bit more about you and just know that you aren't you know like not a person or a bot or a you know well and a lot of nasty stuff has been happening i know lately. poor joan yeah poor joni she got well, and miriam and, yeah so well you i know don't what know happens. if miriam got hacked but she yeah, some things were happening. Yeah. So, that all happens, you know, here, there, and everywhere. If you're interested in many of these stencils that we have shown along with the stamps, you know, that awesome little star stamp, you know, from stencils to stamps and stamps to stencils, that all happens over on our website, which here in about a week or so will be a new one. Yay! Yay. That's pmartistudio.com. Oh, man. I've never said that. Check, check that out. <laughs> Woo! That's bright. That you're going to have to tone that down. Stop. Woo! You need to get that over to a little teal town versus froggy green, green town. Hey, I've got some froggy greens. Thank you, hey. Darcy. Darcy is one of our awesome mods that drops in those hashtags via the Nightbot. Um, thank you to all of our mods. We got Judy P. Lisa was here earlier. You know, these people that have the little wrenches by them, those are our mods. Some, you know, 
some we just give it that the, the wrench so that way they can drop links and others you know do different things so you know they're in charge sometimes yeah. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep oh. yes and I have yeah, I know and Carrie Griffiths he has one that we're gonna launch soon I was just waiting for the new website um so his is gonna so it has to happen in March <laughs> normally we launch Carrie's um monthly stencil at the beginning of the month but this darn website but that's pretty much it thank you guys for hanging out we shall see you either back here on tuesday or over in makers bye guys bye ah